10 things a woman will notice about you at first sight. Love at first sight might not be real. The verdict is still out on that one. But, what is definitely real are the observational skills of a woman. From the tiny speck of dust on your shoulder to the jarring color of your shoes, she notices everything about you the very instant you've walked into the room. And while she leaves no sight unobserved, here are 10 things about you she has definitely noticed under 10 seconds. Maybe you can be mindful about these before you see her next time. 1. Your hair. Maybe it has to do with the fact that it's the topmost feature about you, or maybe it's just to do with the way you style it. Your hair is one of the first things a woman notices about you. When a woman notices your hair, it's probably because you either have a great mane, or a lack of it. And neither of these could be a negative. It could be a simple observation that she has definitely made about you. 2. Your vibe. When someone enters a room, they either carry with them an infectious energy that makes you want to not stop gawking at them, or they carry a negative vibe that makes people want to avoid you like the plague. You might also carry a certain other vibe that is doesn't go unnoticed. You can call it a sort of charismatic appeal. It doesn't have to be loud, it can be silent. But, you always have a vibe about you and women are quick to catch on to that. 3. The color of your shirt slash t-shirt. Whether or not the style of your shirt or t-shirt matters the color of your clothing definitely does catch a woman's attention. White ends up meaning business more often than not with a majority of men wearing white shirts. A dark blue comes a close second. Colors that really stand out include black, even though it seems basic, it's a hue that always stands out for good, or bad, light blue, pink green and brick red. Try it next time. 4. The fitting of your pants. Sounds ridiculous, I know. But, it isn't. See, the reason why women notice this is more to do with instinct. Noticing the way you wear your pants actually says a lot about the kind of person you are and the attitude you reflect. A pair of skinny, fitted jeans shows that you're actually douche gigolo. Or something like that, way deep down, you probably are. A pair of well-fitted denims show you to be modest about who you are while at the same time, knowing that you're worth a lot, a trait that doesn't go unacknowledged. A pair of baggy jeans gives off a laid-back, devil-may-care attitude that could be on the fence. 5. Your hand movements. The way you hold the door when you're walking in, the way you pull out a chair to take your seat, the way your hands either sway while walking, or don't swing at all, we notice all of it. We also notice the way your hands, arms, forearms are sculpted, the hair, scanty, full or shaved, and the color of your skin. If we were artists, we could probably create a sketch just for your hands. No kidding. 6. Your posture. This literally tells us a lot about you. For instance, if you're tall and you hunch, which is the case with most tall men, and I really don't get that or whether you're average height and you glide through a room like a Greek god, well, yes. Or if you have a slumped shoulders sort of thing going on. We notice all of that. And we'll always go for the guy who doesn't hunch, or slump. Taking notes, are we? 7. Your shoulders. We love shoulders. They can tell a woman how broad your frame is, how well you're holding yourself just by looking at your shoulders. If they're too frail and thin, they don't seem strong enough, physically and mentally. If they're too muscular, we might think you look like a show off. If they're well rounded, with just the right amount of edginess, thanks to the way your body is sculpted, we think it looks like you're masculine enough to not need to overtly show it. 8. Your eyes. Big yes on this one. While it is proven that men with light colored eyes do tend to get more of the notice, it's also men with eyes of the darkest brown that get the attention. But there's more to it than just your eye color. Your eyes give out the most information about you, without you even knowing it. Your eyes show if you're intense. Jovial, scanning the room for something, or just overconfident about everything. And we don't need to be body language experts to tell. 9. Your response pattern. It's not so much the way you talk, or the conversation that we observe, as much as we do the way you respond to someone, or something. For instance, how you respond to someone who asks you to introduce yourself to them for the first time, or how you respond to an awkward statement or situation in a room you can't get out of. Whether or not you get flustered, defensive, or aloof, we notice all of it. 10. Your lip movement. The way your lips curve and turn upwards whenever you utter a word, or smile, 
or smirk, the way you purse them when you're listening intently, the color of the skin on your lips because that's always such an intriguing shade, and the way they flush from biting. While the main reason for noticing the way your lips move has to do with our curiosity, it also gives out a little of what you're thinking just nanoseconds before you're about to speak, smile or think something we're not supposed to know.